Hello and welcome to Infinity. A way to perk up a picture is to simply go to an adjustment like curves and to change the blend mode to overlay or one of the other contrast blend modes. But because it's a contrast mode, it means the light's lighter and the black's blacker. So that it's it's fairly dark down here and rather, you know, the cloud is grabbing you a little bit too much now. So you can compensate that in curves with a reverse S-curve. So it's an S backwards because you normally do an S-curve for contrast, but you can do this to reverse it. And that much is, makes a much better picture. However, there's another way of doing this as well which is to go to adjustments and use selective color. Now with this, I take the relative, uncheck that, and go to whites. And now if I turn this up to 50%, the whites go gray. But the blend mode now, if I change this again to overlay, this group here, because it's the contrast blend mode, greys are effectively invisible. So that means that I'm going to get the contrast effect elsewhere, but the whites are going to stay the same. So if I turn this layer off, you can see the contrast, but the whites are kept. You can also use this as a bit of a control, so you can vary that a bit. You can also, with this, go to the darks. So if I go whites and I go down to blacks, so you see it's fairly dark down here. I don't go up to this, I go down to minus 50%. And now what I've got is this back to normal. So again, if I turn this on and off, you can see the parts of the picture which are affected. So it's more of the sky here and the darker parts of the car kept. And again, you can vary this you know, as a control. So I got a separate blacks control and a whites control to give me more control while I'm just trying to improve the contrast within the picture. Anyway, that's it. Thank you very much for watching.